You're good? Oh yeah. <laughs> Red of tat tat. We're gonna see a zipper and zap it too. Yeah. Did they both just trade with Dare? Oh my gosh, <laughs> they cross boards. Mm -hmm. Oh, they swapped yeah. it? Yeah, Brody, Brody has to be red hat. Nico. Robert never plays with a hat on. Wait, is it? Brother, can you tell me which board is who? I think Brody's too. Oh wait, never mind, never mind, never mind. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Sick. Hop back in, deny TY's commentary. I can uh, hop back in, deny TY's commentary. No, I'm just, I'm trying to just sit here until he comes. I bet he's gonna forget and just keep playing friendlies. Tacos and She-Man are going very close. Right now it's Tacos, Pika, and She-Man. Oh, She-Man, Pika, Tacos, Kirby. Uh, Tacos is Kirby. So wow. it's game three then. I feel like She-Man keeps getting so many good wins. This is our one. Because he's good. Yeah, he's, he's amazing. But since he plays Falcon, it's also very volatile. They can lose to a player. He's been switching around a lot. Like I hear at least at locals, he's been playing Yoshi a lot this year. He plays Yoshi a ton. I think he plays Yoshi especially against Falcons. I don't think he likes the Ditto. Mm -hmm. That makes sense. A lot of Falcons don't. I'm beginning to like it less and less. Alright. Pretty pretty even match. Dead even. Mark sends it off stage so he gets the edge card now. Back throw. Excuse me. Oh, it's the man of the hour. Could we all squeeze in here? Do you think that's possible? I think it is. Come on, tight. We might, we might destroy this table. You're, 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 you're a small man. Destroy the table. I am a large man. man. You're a small man compared to me at least. I'm a big boy. All right, so we're game away. Oh, game one. Yeah. Dead even once again. Very close game. The one that viewers really wanted to see. Oh yeah. Is this the greatest matchup in the world? It, it really is. I mean, think about it. What matchup is this matchup? No other. There's, it's a one of a kind. So are, 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 you, are you going greatest matchup in the world off players or Pika Pika? <laughs> okay. Yes, for sure. This is what everyone wants to see all the time. It's what the people crave. It's what they, it's what they decide. They want to see some draft frames. What? <laughs> so I'm not gonna run it. They, they wanted you. Yeah. We were both fan requests. Uh, it's Skyler yeah, too, yeah. right? Some of the Florida guys want to do that. Okay, okay. Ooh, nice layer there, Brody. Is that a little thing here? Hits him with the foot. We got a result in Weed Whack defeated Dogs down to 2 1. Oh, Weed Whack wow. is now a loser sized copy. Oh, congratulations to Weed Whack. Ooh, he's really good. thought Brody was going to take it off the side. Though. He's kind of a slept on player. He doesn't go to a lot. Yeah, I asked him if he could. I'm staying with him. He's going to travel like ever. Outside of you know, Texas. Yo, traveling yeah. is fun, I will tell you that much. Yeah. Uh, I, I saw he I traveled. 12 and a half hours. Yeah, I had a good time. He yeah. went to like Snows of Three, I think. Because I remember, that's when I first met him. And then I saw him at Hit Stun, and then this. It's hard for So I haven't to traveled to anything like big, big. Uh, is this your first like major? This is the biggest drone I've been to, yeah. Oh, uh, you ever been to like a Florida person? I wouldn't have won in Florida. It was, there was only like 33 entrances. So. Yeah. Uh, Florida's cool though, they got a bunch of homies down there. Oh yeah, uh, we're the boys. I, and they're not that far. I want to go back again, except for the last like few tournaments they've had, everyone's like, oh, no one's going. And I'm like, okay, well, then I'm not going to go. Yeah. No one's From, going. Uh, uh, yeah, so like suburbs of Atlanta right outside. Oh, that's the game. Right, taking it. Zero yeah. somewhere. Yeah, that's behind that board. So this is what, best of fives? Yeah. Win of six. Yeah. Oh, okay. Wait, oh, it is. Uh, we oh, got another update. Oh. Quapples is now playing Bo on the second stream. Winner of that game will make top eight. 
Lodo out? Did did Stuck Slash actually beat Lodo? Oh no, Lodo won. Okay, good. Alright. He was upset about it deeply. Yeah, it sounded like he really wanted that win. Lodo's good though. Well, don't you want all the wins, huh? I guess Yeah, we're on it. We're on death. Look at that pressure. Yeah, so uh, there he goes. You know, he just came off really strong and it took a little. 30 second break of hitting and we're going to continue to <laughs> Yeah, Birdie just can't seem to do anything right now. Yeah, Robert's just getting hit back and forth from this uh, Pikachu from Robert. That's how it is sometimes. You just play some ping pong with yourself. The super rare no hat Pikachu. Yes. Brody won game one. Alright, oh, I didn't know what Birdie scored for me. Who needs for Halloween? Well, Robert's no, 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 still no, no, not even Halloween. touched. Oh, edge cancel from Robert. Uh, oh, and Brady makes his first, uh, first strike of the match. Yes, definitely. Only one hit so far in the last two stops. For his waist, I don't know, maybe like 32? Yeah, I think it's 32 or 30. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Oh, oh. Buy it, buy it. Microtransaction, cheers. Get him, get him. Wait, why'd you She might be the love of my life, but she's not the worst. Why'd you swipe left and right, black girl? Are you racist, cheers? No. The secret is to swipe right on the mall. Swipe right on the what? On the mall. The mall? On them all. Not oh, And then not, you filter through it later. Always. So, so who are, uh, uh, Tinder changed their thing where they have like a uh, tequila rating now? They have a limit so, too. Well, so if you swipe right on people that are ugly, it actually hurts your score, so you can't swipe right on hot people later on. There's like a whole algorithm. Yeah, yeah it's crazy. So you have to swipe left on ugly Dating people. Dating after God, serious. Super serious. You have to have taste. It's like, you have, like, to have it's, it's like, you have to like, it's easier to play the stock market than Tinder. Let's swipe left for you. You can make a million dollars on Tinder. What did you do? Alright, give me a minute. I want to watch a few matches up here. You really gonna swipe Where right? Where are you going? You really gonna swipe right? Alright, uh, yeah, I'll go. Totally. It's just, 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 it's All right, back to the match. <laughs> back, back to the smash instead of oh, the other kind of smash. Honestly, this is like how you have to commentate Pika Dittos. Just every every like five minutes, interject and be like, oh, that was good. Oh, pivot F smash from Brody. That was something. You don't see that often. Wait, can they hear everything I just said? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be the vibes. I'm getting canceled. Oh, up. I'm getting canceled. Edge canceled up here. Super canceled. Some really thoughts gonna Lex is like, he doesn't like fat ugly girls. Quit no. longer cancel. No, no. Also, this, this is on. This is on uh, Jason's channel, so he's gonna get canceled too if you say that. <laughs> Sorry, Dark Horse. Uh, if anything, you, you were defending her. I think I'm gonna get canceled. <laughs> Increase rent if you want to survive the game. Well, Josh has kind of brought this back a little bit. Yeah, because no, we're stuck Robert, here. Robert, 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 Robert. What? Robert, Robert's winning this game. Not this time, but Robert's winning this game. Robert just needs one good grab. He's got him off stage. He's kind of where he wants. Oh, that's oh, a grab. Bro, yeah, it doesn't matter. Robert's going to win. Although, I always feel like Robert these has... These guys play all the time. I've watched them play hundred sets in a row. And I walked them, like, we literally had a, a like, like a smash match against us. They played, and I'm not exaggerating, a hundred sets in a row, and they won 100 in a row. Robert won? Yeah, like, they, like, Mark did not get a fucking game on Robert for, like, three hours. Robert's the best player in the world. But Mark beat Robert at Big House. 
because Robert is because of monitors. Robert's the best player. But Warriors is just like better Robert. Robert's uh, uh, is he just like no? Just... Robert's Robert is incomplete Warrior. He, oh. has, he, hasn't, he hasn't finished. He needs his the progress. last piece. Because because Warriors have played for like a decade. Robert's played for like three years. Robert is better than Warrior. Really. He's just still wearing the chains. He's just gotta, he's just gotta break them all. He's just a new He's like, yellow. He'll be the big, he'll be fat Pikachu. So he has like patience. Robert can do all the techniques. So he's actually one of the few new players. They like, I'm say, I hate Robert. He's just boring. They don't play Robert. If they play Robert. They like Robert's actually like one of those technical players. That play. Because he consistently never misses a pivot on Tonsil. He never misses his best players. He never misses any technically challenging attempt. His punish game is just the same. The thing is, because he plays Pikachu, Pikachu doesn't have like crazy ridiculous combos like Fox or fucking Yoshi or anything like that. If Robert played those characters, Robert would be the best at those characters. And he would be technically proficient because he's incredibly proficient with the Pika has. Pivot up tilt, one of the few Pikas that does it. The thing that additionally, additionally, Robert's smart. He's got decisions, he knows where to go, he knows what to do, he strategizes everything he wins. Robert's the best player in the world that's going to get there in a couple years. He's master of all the mechanical problems that he's challenging himself to solve. What about Parabas shoes? He's a messiah. But this is the best player in the world right now in a messiah. Be the chosen one and not be the best. Like, Jesus is the chosen one and he's still this group Yeah, one new. Yeah, like, like, he's like, he's like, he's like, like, like Rob is the Messiah, but he still gets, like, dies, but then he has to give the on the back. Like, you know, smash on. You know, he's like, 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 I think Robert is really good at upbeating other things that aren't true. He does it like instant. Robert has all the tools. Robert's fast, he's technical, he's, he's refined. Look at the tension. He's fast, he's technical, he's well refined, he's patient, uh, and he's intelligent. He's like a five tool player. Robert knows where Brody's going before Brody knows where Brody's going. Robert's smarter than Brody. destroying him right now. Robert's only smarter than Brody. A very smart player. Oh, all right. Cheers. Where's the Robert uh, fan club? Sign up. I, I hate when people say, "I hate Robert. He's so boring and annoying." Have you played the guy? Like he literally doesn't lose because he's just better than you. People get mad. People hate Robert because they don't like someone who's better. And he's so consistently better than you. He has, his floor is ridiculously high. But if you play Robert, he's technical. He's like incredible. For a Pikachu, he's incredible. Not flashy. He's technical. And there's the people who don't come to the difference between technical. Look at those tech chases. Robert's a very technical player. I played against him at Big House, and I hit a pivot up tilt to back her to kill him. I just felt pretty good because it was Robert. Because that's only that, that's, that's oh. like, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, like, that's like what he would do. Yeah, yeah. Pivot F smash. Good coverage oh, work. Good coverage work. Even if you're smash. Oh, well, that was a weird hit, but that's good. Saying, like, he's got, 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 but there's a position in which even this way to be telegraphed, you can always get back because you can't be fast enough to cover the opposite that he has. And so that distance you knew Robert was getting clapped was getting back and then Robert was part of the brother. He missed the dash or something. Maybe you like turn around to the dash. Still gonna have to play like perfect. You sure they can even pass far away? What's up? You sure they can even pass far away? I mean, you're, you're talking loud enough, don't worry. I yeah. Don't, I'm, like, I like, I'm like a gentle giant, I don't whisper. I mean, I whisper, I don't ever yell. Wait, someone I'm delicate. I'm a delicate favorite. Wait, people, someone commented, Chris, Cheers knows everything. Cheers is always right. That means they can hear you. This mic is also like built for like, I'm pretty sure, detecting a large range. It doesn't even look like it. It's like, I think it is though. It's usually the ones that are mounted like this will be like, they're meant to like, Cheers had the biggest commentator to curse. What kind of thing Robert just wanted? You said, Bark's making a big comeback, and then the second you said it, he died. I also said Robert's gonna win. 
Well, well he died before he said that. I don't think it's the prophecy. Robert's gonna win. <laughs> He's gonna win it all. Like, they, didn't make, they, didn't make, they found the sea scrolls, right? Like, one of those said Robert's gonna win. How much time do you think Robert needs to peak? Or, or does he have no peak? What, he like five blossoms? <laughs> yeah, sure. So, Robert, Robert is the Terminator of the status. Like, there's no peak, it's just Judgment Day. It's not a question of when is he peak, it's a question of when is Judgment Day. Right, I'm gonna go to the basketball quick. Alright. Incredible patience in his play and just knowing when to take the moment. He pulls back. He'll stop. Yeah. He gets out of space. He pulls back. He gets down. He wants to get stage control. He's, he's, he's not a show that he does. I mean, obviously, every character wants to, every person wants to take a stock at all times. But his goal is not, you know, um, if I get the opportunity to take a stock, I will. My focus is trying to win the And that's what makes Robert great. It's also what makes Robert great. Robert is not a type of player. Uh, he's no. not considered a fast moving player. Uh, he doesn't have control of Broncos. Mark's incredibly smart, and the way that he makes the decisions. Robert as well, and they're players that look to win the neutral, and they look to make a stock. And that's the key difference. If you look to win the neutral, instead of winning the stock, eventually you'll take a stock and win the neutral always. You don't have to win the neutral and take a stock now, you can win the neutral and take a stock later. And so if you always win the neutral, you always take a stock. It's a, it's a perspective thing that I like about it. I feel like the thing with Mark, and to an extent dark, but not as much, just they had incredible fundamentals because they've just played the game for like so long. They played for long, but they have like competitive. They like, they're like, yeah. they're honestly fairly new to uh, the competitive game. They're, like, they're not like playing a lot of the online guys that have been playing for decades. Uh, but they're just, they're just, I don't think the learning curve is that steep. And so I think if you're just a smart person, or a basic person, and like, you can evaluate like neutral and Consequences to decisions, then you can pick up the game fairly quickly and you can get to a competitive level. The Robert's playing for two years and he's at this level where he's got to be barring the game for grand final, game grand final, for what it is. Because Robert's natural instinct for just like a confident person translates to the game for successful player. Uh, and, and, and all you have to work on then at that point for like Robert is execution and mechanics. Oh. That was beautiful! That was fucking beautiful! So you went for the pivots, went to go to the up tilt, realized that the barge roll couldn't get covered by the up tilt, and then full dashed into the grab. It's not gonna kill, it's going to optimize the amount of damage and the punish game of Robert Hatch. That's, like, that's a high area. People want to look at the coolest combo that someone did when they got four stock and they got the one fucking combo in, or three stock and they got one combo in. That's a high level. It's decision making in real time in very fast pace that is technically challenging and results in an advantage within the game. He lost that, that, that neutral because Mark ended up coming back in full control of that team. Yeah, that, that was a beautiful game. That was incredibly smart and just his reaction times. Yeah, I just think that reaction time was insane. Yeah, that would that the 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 went for the pivot up tilt, went right for the pivot, double pivoted, we also up tilt couldn't connect, and forfeited the up tilt to go for the ground. And that's exactly what he did because he went for the up tilt. Yeah, no jump. Mark water right back though. He's got his advantage. He keeps going for the frisky. It's looking like Alpha and Alpha there. Robert definitely didn't do that F air. If you're forward facing his beacon, and you're really rising up air, the other beacon was always on it. Oh, did he But But uh, Robinson and Ange just So Mark's gonna up beat back. What does Robert do? Oh, wow! Oh, the ledge gets up beat! Did you fucking see that? He did up beat, ledge gets up beat. There was zero frames of vulnerability. Oh, he's dead. He failed to escape Robert. Wow, it was like so fast. Why would you ever jab breath? 
What? What was it? Probably jab always goes jab around because uh, it's it's a oh, grab takes six frames and jab takes two. So if unless they can GI out of jab takes, jab 